In today's HealthCast, a warning about a life-threatening condition that is diagnosed every 20 seconds right here in the U.S. Because it spreads quickly, sepsis ends up causing more deaths than prostate cancer, breast cancer, and AIDS combined. Our medical specialist, Christy Kruger, takes a closer look at how a simple cut or infection can quickly take a tragic turn. I want to go over this file with you. Too. In her executive assistant role at Nova Southeastern University, Karen Reinford Perez works closely with health professionals every day. Still, when she was diagnosed with a potentially deadly condition, she and her co workers were shocked. It all began with what Karen thought was the stomach flu. I'm not a complainer. So you, and that's what we tend to do. You push through the symptoms or what you're feeling because it's going to get better, it's going to get better, it's going to, and it, it didn't get better, it got worse. Karen went to the emergency room, but quickly found herself in the ICU. The diagnosis, sepsis. Sepsis essentially is something that happens as a result of infection that goes undiagnosed and untreated. And that's important to know because essentially it can happen to any of us. So this already... Microbiologist Dr. Bindu Mai teaches health students about the signs of sepsis, which is the body's extreme response to common bacterial infections. The symptoms include shivering or fever, pain or discomfort, confusion, trouble breathing, and a high heart rate. Dr. Mai told me educating everyone about sepsis is now her passion. The condition took her twin sister's life after she was burned in a house fire. She was so much better than I at everything. I couldn't quite comprehend why I would survive and she didn't. Um, so I, I think it's essential for me to make my life mean something. As for Karen, she knows how lucky she is to be alive. I feel great. <laughs> I got the um, treatment necessary and um, learned things about my body that I didn't know. And I learned the most, the thing I learned the most is that don't ignore the symptoms. It was scary. Yeah, it really is scary. One out of every three patients who dies in the hospital has sepsis. Older adults and young children, as well as people with chronic health problems, are all at risk. But it can really happen to any of us. That's why you need to know your body and take any of these kinds of symptoms very, very seriously. With your HealthCast today, I'm Christy Krueger.